Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Portal Stories Mel. We uh, overslept once again in a portal game, of course, uh, but now we're going to have to keep testing, I guess, before we can get out of here. Well, so that's just going to drop a cube into nothingness, and that's probably not what I want to do, so I'm going to have to probably just disable that, like that. Can I have the cube again? Thank you put that onto this switch here, which disables that. So we need to do something. Let's head over here. We can take this blue gel and put it onto that platform there. Which is good for us. Uh, especially now, because we can move the portals around. So we can put that up there and that there. Which means that if we stand on the switch now, the cube bounces through without being destroyed. And now we have it on this side. Which means we can do other things, I guess. I guess... we. I don't know how helpful that is. I mean, that's just another way to solve the first part of the test, I guess. Uh, but now, let's put that there. And I need to go through alone, probably. Let's do that. Just to go over here. So we need the cube, which we can probably just do something like that to get. Except I also need the blue gel up here so I can get around. A little bit easier. Cool. Uh, put that there. Okay. Let's go get the cube. Just like this. Okay. Now we can put this in the button. To get out of here. So about before, you can get why I said all that, right? I'd rather not have my one chance of escape have a panic attack and die on me after years of being suspended in a faulty relaxation vault. Which could be a real possibility, because as my records show, the old test could cause heart attacks after small exposure to the chemicals. And you were pumped full of them. So, let's all just take a breath and start over. My name's Virgil. I'm a core from up in the Enrichment Center. And before you even think of asking, yes, there is a building above you, and yes, I came from it. I'm not crazy. Don't be too alarmed, though. A lot's changed since you got put on ice. Okay. Um. Again, it's at least he's being honest. Also, whoa, that's a bad combination of things. I don't know how I, well I thought this through. Um. Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to do this. Don't bounce, please. Thank you. What is that over there? Is that just lighting? I guess it's just lighting. From outside of the test chamber. Oh, well, that's a shame. But it means I didn't destroy the cube, so... Let's go get that. Please. 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 Thank you. Okay. So we can take this now. Put this onto the button. Just like that. Ah, uh, but I suspect we're probably going to need a few other things... Now that we're through here. Like, probably the cube. Except I also might need the goop. Although there's goop here, so I might not. Let me see what we have here. We have... This. Which might just mean... Something. Also, I can't use that goop. That's the way out of here. By the looks of it. I don't think we're going to the elevator. I think we're just going to the pipe. Um, so I need to fall... I need to disable this thing. Ah, uh, let's get the cube. From over here. Okay. Stop that. Oh, that starts that there, which is not... Gr that's not a great combination of things. Um. Um, hang on. I think I can just go up here, please, and I can shoot that there, cool. That works. Let's 
Let's go through here. Activate that. Good job, Mel. See that pipe there? That the repulsion gel's leaking on? That'll take you to the pumping station. Jump down and walk on it. Oh, and try not to fall off. That goo down there is corrosive, and it doesn't like human skin. Okay. Cool. Up we go. Okay. Seems to be pretty good. Am I going down from here? I think I'm just going down from here. Pretty sure. Okay. Now where? This way or other way? Other way. Don't think there's anything else to look at. Okay, this way. Now, according to my records of this room, there should be a turret shooting range at the far side of the room. If you can get through there, you should be able to get to the fourth testing track. That'll take you up to where I am. Okay. Uh, you're being very helpful considering you're in a completely different area. Now, I also need to go up there, possibly. So let's do that, except I probably want to actually do it there, so I'm not just falling off immediately. Okay. Now, what can I do up here? I'm going to fling myself, possibly, but where can I fling myself to? Over this way? Hang on. Just going to jump around here. Okay. So I think I'm flinging myself this way, right? Let's try that. I'm going to head back this way if I can. Oh, careful. Very careful. So careful. Okay. Let's fling. Ourselves. To victory. Huh. That was odd. Normally when people do that sort of thing, they just fly through the hole in the wall. Hmm. Guess not this time. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, anyway, let's activate gel pressure control for pump station better. That gel should help you get past those turrets. Okay, so we have that now. We don't need to be up here anymore, so let's jump down. So we have the goop, which means we can do a whole bunch of gooping in here. Which will make it easier to get through faster, I suppose. Um... Let's test this out and see if we can survive this, hopefully. Run! Okay, cool. That's that all done. Override switch. I don't know what that did. I think that might have just... Oh, that just disabled them. Cool. Also, there's... A straight shot to the next testing track. Oh, I guess I'm not looking at that pump station then. Okay. The one with the giant wheel on it. Okay, let's open this. Do it again. It'll open this time, I swear. Just give it some elbow grease. Okay. Oh, come on, you've got this. One more shot. Okay. It's a bit tough though. Oh, great. You can fling yourself all over the place and get past some old turrets that are firing live rounds, but you can't get a door open. I'm sorry. What kind of Olympian are you? I don't know. Ugh. I can't remember. Right. Let's see what we can do. There's a longer route through a repulsion gel pumping station. Guess you're going to have to go that way. Yep. A long way round. <laughs> you matter risks again. Okay. You can get through this pumping station and prepare yourself to get out of Bravo Volta into the Lima whiskey testing track. That should bring you closer to me and to your own escape from this facility. Hey everybody, it's Future Me here. I missed a few things, so I'm just gonna go back down here and check out this thing over here because it will actually talk to us. We painted subliminal messaging all over the walls in this next test. So if you feel the sudden urge to buy a bunch of aperture science merchandise afterwards, we'll count that as a success. There's also another one on the other side of the room here that I wanna also go get. Aperture's early tests weren't always that successful. 
You were unlucky. That was the worst test Cave Johnson ever greenlit. But it's nice for me to have an Olympian at my disposal. Yeah, I have that information from you at the 1936 Nuremberg Olympics. You should have gotten that silver medal. The local zoo made an offer we couldn't refuse. So you may encounter several grizzly bears and or lions in this next test. Okay. The local zoo ah, made stop an offer talking. We refuse. So you may encounter several grizzly bears and or lions in this next test. We're in stasis for a very long time. Okay. Go through this way, I guess. Oh, this is just an office, but we can use this wall here probably. Also, there's a crate here that we can pick up. Good to know. We can also destroy it, which is probably not that helpful to us then. I don't know if I was supposed to do that, but it's probably fine. Okay. I think we're fine. Let's uh launch ourselves if I can. Manage that. I think that's what I want to do. Probably. Ah, there we go. Whoa, look at that. So much stuff to look at. Now, do I need to go in the test or just around the test? Possibly just around the test. Alright, look. I'm sorry for what I said back there. We're in this together. You're my ticket out of the junkyard down here. I'm your ticket to the outside world. I'll do my best to keep the insults at a minimum. Just, just, just try harder next time. Well, so I missed this over here. If you see me, if you just see some random cuts, that's because I had to fix a few things in this video. Those of you that smoke may want to steer clear of this next one. We've coated the propulsion gel in gasoline. Thought it might increase the acceleration properties of the gel. Turns out it's just extremely flammable and ignites when you run on it. And also if we go down here to the front of the test. And our good luck just ran out. I can't override the locks to that test chamber. Maybe. Maybe there's a way over it. See if there's anything you can use. And when we're on top of the test, we can actually portal to over there. And go find another portable surface so we can get across. We can make our way over to this secret area. Very special secret. Sorry to say this, but there's I forgot where it was, so I there. didn't do it earlier. Nothing at all. You're wasting your time. Nothing life-changing up there at all. That's what they all say, but you know what? You're you're talking about it, so there must be something. Have to go all the way down across here though. All the way. All the walking. Let's just check this door. See, I told you. Mel, we need to talk. I know some cores lie really badly about things like that, but I was telling the truth. Trust me a little more, huh? Oh, and I hope you enjoyed the long walk down. Yep, there's no secrets here. I think you might get an achievement though, but yeah, we can't do anything here, so we have to walk all the way back. So, also I like just looking around in these areas. There's just so much stuff to look at in the environment. So many cool things. I have to walk all the way back to the thing so I can get it back across because there's no portable surface to send it closer. Do 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 The staircase goes up forever if you keep going up like that. Go down the other way. Do 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 do. Singing makes it a bit way better. Um, um, I kind of have a bit of bad news. Bad news. Yeah, yeah, I know. You don't want to hear any more bad news after the security override. I couldn't do. Uh, my records of this sphere are out of date, to say the least. There should be an exit after the third section of this test. However, I don't know if getting there will be that easy. You got it in you, though. You're my Olympian. Who might not have a beating heart anymore. Okay. 
Well, thank you for your concern. Uh, but anyway, let's activate a few more things here. Just like that. Uh, and I need a cube, I believe. So let's do that. Put that there. And let's go up here. Combine these two areas. Just like that. And let's launch ourselves. Cool. What can I do now? I can't go that way because that's locked. I can't disable this door, I don't think, but I might just be able to fling myself up. Like that. Now this closes that. Okay, so I can go back now. I can get a cube. I can get gel. Let's do that. Hey, blue portal. Just need to remember that. Okay, blue portal. So we can place that there now. Which means we can just jump across that. But I think I need to also take the cube with me. That was a very impressive jump. With that amount of group there. But anyway. We can get out of here. Hazardous materials. Okay, where am I going? I can't. Ah. Okay. Whoa, where am I? I'm here. I'm supposed to be here. Good. Great. Oh my goodness. That was very confusing. But anyway. Let's put that orange portal there now, with that blue portal there. And now we just need to orange portal there once we're flowing ourselves through, which should be good. Wait a second, I'm, I'm getting some strange voice coming through. I'll patch it through. Scanning Lima Whiskey, 70% complete. No vital signs detected. Initiating flooding procedure. That's coming up from new app. Um. What's a, my scans are going nuts. Something's happening. The sphere's unstable. Get out of here. Run! Okay. Um, that also doesn't deactivate that. This deactivates that. So let's put that on that. So we can go back again. And grab something. I think. Oh, maybe not. Hang on. What deactivates that? Something else. Um. Okay. I need to get that button there. Oh wait, I can use- I can do that. That's what I can do. Cool, so let's do that then. Fling ourselves up here. Now we have this. To put... Somewhere. I can also press this button here to... Deactivate that. Again, I don't know how helpful that is. Um, oh, that's interesting. There's a thing there. Oh, shaking. Hang on, let me deactivate that and put that there. And now we can take the cube out and put that on the switch as well. Which means we can now use that wall and that wall to go to victory. Well, there we go. Anything else you want to say, Virgil? Other than the fact that the everything is being flooded? Guess not. Up we go! Well, that could have ended everything very suddenly. 
Let's drop down here if I can. Okay. That explosion blew the whole toxic goo pump station apart. It's letting flood wars up. We gotta get out of here. It's not safe. Get through the control centers. There's a transition seal leading up to where I am. Okay. Hurry before this whole place floods or comes down. Oh dear. Oh dear. It's fine. Oh, hey, ele elevator. Good. No, I can't go down. Oh, I can't go down. Okay, go up. Well, why would I take the stairs? Yeah. No, it's fine. Oh, hey. <laughs> what if I take it back down again? Nope, go back up. No! No, go back up. Fine. If that's the way it's gonna be, I'm gonna take the stairs now. Since you're complaining so much. Oh, this is a lot of stairs. Wow. Wow, that's a lot of stairs. I'm glad I took the elevator the first time. Uh, anyway, let's go over this way. Also, if we go up the stairs, instead of taking the elevator, don't use the elevator at all. Your life is at stake, and you're going to walk up the stairs with falling rocks everywhere. I get you're an Olympian track runner and all, but what's wrong with you? He complains either way you go, so it doesn't matter. Also, I went to Noclip and found this Lone Wolf written on a wall. Lone Wolf 2056, specifically. More debris falling. Oh, thank you. Um... I don't know what that is supposed to be. Main office, I guess? Yes, this way. This is fine. You gotta get out of there. The room's filling with smoke. Oh dear. Good. At least you won't suffocate in this room. But you still need to find a way to get to the transition seal. Whoa. Don't do that. You will break the place down in your head. Um, well, I made things slightly worse, but now this is op op open over here, so let's use that water through uh, the portal. I that oh, oh, right. Get going before something else happens. Wow. If you'd been there a few seconds earlier, you'd have been incinerated. Oh. Like the maker you were, though. <sighs> I need the muscle. Yes. That doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. That doesn't do anything. Okay. Just keep moving. Now what is this? Um... Is there anything I need? I don't think so. Caution. The sign is radioactive. <laughs> that, thank you. Just what I needed. In the event of flooding, seek air pockets. Propulsion gel. Um. Okay. Caution. Okay. Bad news. Uh, when the pump station blew, the floodgates opened up wide. Uh oh. Toxic goose rising fast. The sensors maxed out ages ago. Warning lights. Woo! Going crazy all around. This just got a lot more serious. Okay. Cool. I'm gonna need to go through here. And just run. Alright, you're at quality control center 95D. Only a bit further and you'll be at the hatch up to me. Hurry. I'll try to slow the goo down a bit. That's a great picture. Um, cube. Okay. I have cube. Um, I have blue gel. I don't know what I can do with this cube though, but I can definitely take that blue gel with me to use that. So let's put that here. Ah, uh, but I don't want to get my cube gooped. Great. Another 
Hang on. I'm sure I can. So, Mel, why don't you take your time? Look around here. Oh my goodness. Please come back. Oh. It's fine. Don't take all day. I probably shouldn't have taken my cube through there. I should have just gone around that way. I think it's actually just going to be faster to reset the cube. Get a new one, since we don't have to go through that hole anymore. Which has the goop going through. Let's go this way. A ring. Going as fast as I can. Okay, so now we can use this cube to climb up here, I believe. Could also possibly take it with us. If I play my cards right, maybe. I don't know if I need it though. Possibly not. Crawling through the vents. I have cube. Oh, I can't take cube with me. Goodbye, cube. You've been my friend. The doors are locked. Ah, uh, back in the day, the wiring was a bit strange sometimes. Try turning some machinery on. See if that also unlocks the doors. Yeah, that would be f smart designing stuff. Anything? Wow. The, the wow. Worked. It did. Uh, I mean, great. Oh my goodness. Well, that's just great. Can't we get through a room once without stop blowing up or blocking our way? Ugh. Try to find some water again or something. Some water up there. Some water in here. This door's op also open. I don't think there's anything for me here except for that. But I don't think that's where I want to go, so I'm going to put a portal up there. And go through here. Cool. And we have that water there. We can take it back the other way. To over here. And that should deal with the fire. Great. From there, there's just the walls. Don't get comfy though. I pulled the plug on some emergency runoff dams, but the goo is still rising. Okay. 1979. Wow. This place is massive. Whoever built this place must be a great architect. Uh, not necessarily. Up high at the back side of this room is a control panel. It controls the hatch. Try to get there. Okay, we have a goal. Let's activate this. So we have that now. Which could be helpful. Quite possibly. Or possibly not. Uh, actually, it is actually quite helpful because we can put it on these two surfaces here. And now, if I had done this correctly, I can bounce up, mostly. Up we go, please. Land up there. Thank you. Okay, we're up here now. So, now... Let's go this way, I guess. No, don't get stuck on a thing. Arg, Arg. Okay, make this jump properly. There we go. Yes, we're up here now. We can activate the other one. So let's activate this. And now I probably want to use this over here to get up further. Get out of here, that'd be great. Just gonna go around the long way since it's probably easier. Okay, so what can I do with all this? I have a way to go through there. Where do I want to go to from? Up there, maybe? Hang on. Let me go through here since I can do that apparently. Oh, okay. I see, I see, I see. Let's do that. And do this. Okay, we're up here now. Um. Okay, danger. In the event of flooding, seek air pockets. Yes, I read that already. Records show that at least two people were needed to activate the vault hatch. You're one person. There's a bit of a problem there. 
Well, I'm sure we can figure something out. You know, got it. Didn't I? Oh, hey. There we go. Okay, we've made it to, I believe, the modern aperture. Let's jump into this cage. Let's go up. Also, why do they design these giant vaults this way? Good news is the group's going up here. Yay! I'll seal up the hatch and we don't have to worry about that anymore. <sighs> That's definitely a plus. Definitely. Okay. Whoa. The ascent. Oh, great. You're here. I can finally get out of this technological nightmare. If you can get into the offices. I'm saved. You just might have to get around a few security defenses, though, trying to keep the giant human-eating rats out. Um, giant human-eating human, human eating rats, that's not a big problem, is it? Uh, anyway, it's probably fine. Let me just figure out where I'm going for a second. That didn't really do anything. It's okay. I go through there. And here. Okay, what else can I do here? Just go for a walk, I guess. Panel there that I can use. And probably this here. I don't know which angles they need need to be at, but that's probably fine. Just need to get up like that. Cool. Okay. Hey, the floor is getting quite cold here. Okay, I'm coming. Hey, hey, uh, over here. I'm right over here. Hello. What's up? Hey, Mel. Nice to finally see you. It's kind of dark here, though. You should turn the power on so we can get the lights working. There's more offices on the other side of the double doors. Check there. Turn the power on first, then pick me up. Also, he has, like, the, the Aperture logo from the, like, pre-modern bit. Just, yeah, it's so cool. <laughs> anyway. It's like the 70s or 80s Aperture logo. Anyway, that is it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.